Hey everybody, Tim Helston here again. So another modification, as you know, I like to take my dog, Asher. There's Asher. Hi Asher, he's a whippet. He likes to run, but he also loves the pebble. Uh, it's his pebble actually. I bought it and he gets to be my co-pilot. Hi Asher. Everybody say hi Asher. Hi Asher. Good boy. Anyway, he wants to go in the pebble. That's why he's out here. He's waiting to get in. He's just waiting for permission. But anyway, one of the things that needs to happen is he needs to have a safety belt. So what I did was I have these uh, car safety belts that you use for your vehicle. Uh, this one had a clip that goes into your seatbelt holder, uh, like the seatbelt uh, lock-in. But I cut that off with a grinder. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically, I don't know how you'll see this, but I'm going to open up the seat and inside of here you'll see ouch, you'll see the battery section here uh, you'll see the batteries here anyway there's this aluminum rail what I'm gonna do is I'm just basically gonna put this on there and then I'm gonna loop it in there and then it comes out the seat and then the dog will be able to be fastened in there and nice and safe i unfortunately need two hands to do that so that's the video for now and i'll show you what it looks like when it's done back again okay so what i did was i just basically slid it through here and then as you can see i just looped it and then once that closes put it out front close this and now i can basically still use the buckle part here to lengthen it or shorten it if I need to, depending on the dog. So that's, and then that's their seatbelt. So they basically wear a harness and this just keeps them in the bike. And that's what I've done for that upgrade.